ByteDance just unleashed UITARS 1.5, and it's about to change everything we know about AI agents. This isn't just another model update. It's a fundamental shift in how machines perceive and interact with our digital world. If you're excited about the future of AI, hit that subscribe button right now to stay updated on the cutting edge of technology. UITARS 1.5 is the first truly native agent that sees your screen exactly like you do. Unlike other models that rely on specialized APIs or function calls, UITARS directly processes screenshots and generates human-like control actions. The results? It's outperforming OpenAI's operator and Claude 3.7 across multiple benchmarks. What makes UITARS 1.5 so revolutionary is its integrated perception and reasoning system. The model jointly encodes screen images and textual instructions, supporting complex task understanding through a multi-step think-then-act mechanism. This separation of high-level planning from low-level execution is why it's crushing benchmarks that other models struggle with. Let's look at the numbers. On OS World, a 100-step GUI benchmark, UI TARS 1.5 achieves a 42.5% success rate compared to OpenAI operators 36.4%, and Claude 3.7's 3%, 28%. On Windows Agent Arena, it scores 42.1%, significantly outperforming previous state-of-the-art models that topped out at 29.8%. But where UI TARS 1.5 truly shines is in visual grounding. On ScreenSpot Pro, a complex grounding benchmark, it scores 61.6%, more than double what Operator and Claude 3.7 could achieve. This isn't just an incremental improvement, it's a complete paradigm shift. The most impressive feat? UITARS 1.5 achieves a perfect 100% task completion rate across 14 mini-games in the Pokey Games benchmark. For comparison, OpenAI's model struggled to even complete some of these games, while Claude 3.7 performed even worse. What's happening under the hood is fascinating. UITARS 1.5 uses five perception layers, element descriptions, dense captions explaining screen layouts, state transition tracking, Q&A training for element location, and mark prompting that links words to specific pixels. This comprehensive approach allows it to understand interfaces in ways other models simply cannot. The unified action space is another game changer. Whether it's Windows, Android, or web environments, UITARS 1.5 uses the same standardized cross-platform action framework. This means developers can build once and deploy everywhere. Perhaps most impressive is the self-evolution capability. Through continuous interaction and feedback, UITARS 1.5 can iteratively refine its behavior by analyzing previous interactions. This reduces reliance on curated demonstrations and allows the model to improve itself over time. ByteDance has open-sourced UITARS 1.5 under the Apache 2.0 license, making it accessible to researchers and developers worldwide. The 7B parameter version is available on Hugging Face, though it's worth noting this smaller model focuses primarily on general computer use capabilities rather than the game-based scenarios where the full UITARS 1.5 excels. But actually, there are limitations to be aware of. The model requires substantial computational resources, may occasionally generate inaccurate descriptions or take suboptimal actions, and could potentially be misused for unauthorized access to protected content. ByteDance acknowledges these concerns and is conducting extensive internal safety evaluations. Looking ahead, UITARS 1.5 represents a significant step toward more sophisticated agentic experiences capable of performing real-world actions. As these models continue to evolve, we're moving closer to AI systems that can truly understand and navigate our digital world just as humans do. If you've been waiting for an AI agent that can actually control interfaces rather than just talk about them, UITARS 1.5 might be your answer. Its combination of perception, reasoning, and direct action creates something that feels closer to an actual digital assistant than anything we've seen before. If you found this video informative, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to stay updated on the latest AI breakthroughs. From deep learning to robotics, I cover it all. Was there anything I missed about UITARS 1.5 that you'd like to know more about? Let me know in the comments below.